I was diagnosed when I was nine, but I started getting headaches when I was six. It continued to happen, so we finally found out that it was YMY when I was nine. I had um, two brain surgeries when I was in fourth grade. I just had to learn to regain my speech, and it was hard to talk to my parents because I couldn't understand. She actually handled it extremely well, much better than I thought. When we were in, uh, at Sanford, uh, we were in ICU probably a total of about 10 days, and uh, she saw a lot of uh, infants and small children in ICU, and uh, I think she took a lot of that to heart and wanted to do something to help other kids that may be going through a process similar to that. Oh, it was terrible being in the hospital, I and mean, I was only in it for a couple of weeks. I couldn't imagine other people being in there for a long time. So I wanted to make a website that would like, help children like me or that have a worse disease than me. She didn't just want a website to be built, she, I wanted her to be part of the creative process. She constantly was pushing the envelope on what we were trying to do. For me, if I had just built it based on what she had wanted, we would have ended up with a, a scaled back game. It probably still would have been fun, but it wouldn't have captured as much of her spirit that was in there. It almost feels like it's her voice talking through the website. If she hadn't been pushing it, I don't think it would have been as nearly as great as it is. The great part about it is that they just kept working together and then Alyssa would come up with an idea. Welcome to the wide world web of Alicia's Wish. I've had the privilege of working with Alyssa for about two years now on this wish, so it's been a fun one. So do you want to kind of show them around? First step was kind of just getting a big picture of what all we wanted to communicate. We wanted to be able to tell Alyssa's story. She kind of wanted to also be able to translate some of the, the doctor lingo, and she kind of breaks down, what does that mean? What can you expect? What's the doctor actually trying to say? And there was a section dedicated just to like what to expect when you go to the hospital. So there's tips of what to bring, stuffed animals from home, or postcards you could send to friends. And then the game part of the website is where, I mean, I got to go a little bit wild, Alyssa got to go a little bit wild with ideas. I think the most Alyssa part's the gaming. She's into video games and just the way that, you know, someone of her age can come up with this idea and, you know, create something fun to do was really awesome. They would work like side by side to like build out these pages of the website. And so I've told her she can officially add it to her resume. She's a website builder. I was really surprised that it took that much to create a website. I didn't know it was that much. I think it was really fun for her to see kind of the back end of how things are created like that. Um, I, it was a lot of fun watching her learn through the process as well. You know, she could have wished to go somewhere, to be someone. The sky's the limit with wishes, and Alyssa, we just, it's been a privilege to work with you to grant this wish specifically that helps other kids. We've seen everything over the years that kids want and, and need in their lives to feel better about their circumstance. But what's really incredible about Alyssa's wish is that she wanted to create something to help other kiddos. It's those kinds of wishes that are just really magical and beautiful because they're all about trying to do something for other people. Cases like Alyssa's wish and so many other wishes that we grant every day, um, they have this transformative impact on not just the child like Alyssa, but the whole community around that kiddo. She is probably just the most giving person that I've ever met. Just to, to take an opportunity, like to use her wish for something so selfless as to, to give back to other kids was inspiring. To get to play a part in somebody else's wish was just beyond humbling for sure.